Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's Natalie here. Today I am filming a day in my life, a very true day in my life. I was filming a week in my life this week, but I really wanted to do one video on just taking you throughout an entire day. Living in New York City, this is still my second week here, so I'm not quite in a like real routine yet, but I did still want to show you guys kind of what I do day to day, hour by hour, just let you guys in a little bit. It is currently... 8 a.m. I woke up at 7 this morning. I just naturally wake up early. I think it's because I do get some light in my room and also there is a lot of noise outside. I don't know if you can hear it right now, but especially when like the garbage comes and picks up the trash or there's just beeping outside and you know, it's just the New York City noises that are out there. So I typically wake up a little earlier and I don't mind it because I do want to just get an early start to my morning and to my day and just like be very productive. Right now, I just want my face and brush my teeth and I am going to get ready for the gym I have a personal training session today I don't normally do personal training but today I do have one because I just joined a gym and they give you one free personal training session so I signed up for it this morning normally I do go to the gym in the morning I just like do my own thing so if you guys want to see what I do I am going to be filming a week of workouts soon so be sure to subscribe so that you guys can see that and turn on my push notifications but right now I have personal training so I want to show you guys like everything I do to try to stay my healthiest okay guys so my mom gave me these they're called eight greens and apparently they're these like green juices they're little green tablets and you put them in your water and it like makes this like sparkling green juice and it has all of these it contains all of this in one green juice so my mom swears by this she thinks it's literally like a cure for so many things and my mom's very very into like natural medicine and holistic medicine not to say that she's not into like western medicine but she does like a mix of both so i'm gonna try this she gave these to me i went home yesterday for like 24 hours and she gave these to me so i'll have them linked down below if you guys want to try them but yeah i'm just gonna put them in my water and try it out and i also brought my care of vitamins with me so i'm gonna grab one of these and also take these for the morning. I really love making sure I get my vitamins in. It tastes really good, you guys. So this actually, it doesn't taste bad at all. It has like lemon and orange in it, I'm pretty sure. So kind of has like a citrusy, sparkling taste. It's like low-key, tastes like a healthy Sprite. I also wanted to thank Native for sponsoring today's video. I also asked you guys your favorite natural deodorants, and so many of you guys said that you loved the Native natural deodorant. I posted it on my Instagram story like a month ago, so I'm really excited to be doing this sponsorship. So Native deodorant is filled with ingredients that are found in nature, like coconut oil, which has a lot of antimicrobial properties, and also shea butter, which is for moisturizing, and then it also has tapioca. The tapioca starch is to absorb wetness, so you're not like sweating like crazy because it actually does work and I have been using it for a very long time. It's formulated without any aluminum or parabens or talc which again I think is really really important and another thing that I love about it is that it is not tested on animals and that's one thing I find hard is to find companies that are not tested on animals. But yeah, I just love that this is just like a wholesome product. And I got the coconut vanilla scent because you guys know I'm obsessed with coconut and I love the smell of vanilla. So I'm, I was like, yes, no brainer. I have to get the coconut vanilla scent. They have lavender and rose, eucalyptus mint, and cucumber mint. So all of those sound really good, but I'm just obsessed with coconut and vanilla. So I decided to try this one. I do have 20% off for you guys. So click on the link down below so you can can try your deodorant it's also completely risk-free they do free returns if you guys don't like it but again I'm just trying to live a healthier lifestyle in all aspects of my life I'm obsessed with the fragrance of it and I also just really really like that it actually works it doesn't make me sweat it doesn't stain my clothes it doesn't like leave marks on me like it's actually such a great product so if you guys are looking for a natural deodorant which I know is hard to come across a really good one that works and does what it says it's going to do but to get 20% off your first purchase go to nativedeodorant.com 
off. But yeah, I'm about to put it on, go to the gym, and New York has been disgustingly hot lately. I'm hoping today is a little cooler. And I like hate the cold and I actually like the heat, but like walking around everywhere and like going in the subway and just like being with a crowd of people at all times, I'm like, all right, I'm ready for it to get like a tad cooler. <laughs> Workout. It was hard. He made me do some cardio and I'm like, I hate cardio. I'm doing one more with him because that was like half Seeing like my skills and then the other half was a workout. So I still have one more full workout session with him So I will be doing that next week, but I was gonna record the workout but like It just felt so awkward asking my personal trainer that I just met that day to record it So I'm gonna record it next week when I do my week of workouts video. So be sure to check that out So don't smell though <laughs> This is my workout gym outfit of the day. If I showed you guys, just all black from Aloe, from 21, Nike. Um, I also wanted to give you guys an update. I got this um, clothing rack and I'm going to be assembling it while I'm still sweaty, but first I'm going to eat breakfast. So I'm gonna make some eggs in my wonderful kitchen and eat that. <laughs> Okay guys, I just rearranged my room and built this clothing rack and I think I am probably the worst handyman builder ever. Like this clothing rack would probably take the normal person like 15 minutes to make and it took me like almost an hour. So I'm gonna show you guys how I rearrange my room. I really do like it. I do think it's starting to get a little cluttered so I'm nervous because like I think anytime I buy anything I'm just gonna have to like get rid of something and have that be the mindset because I don't want it to be cluttered but i'll show you guys so here's an overview of my room now so i just built a clothing rack and at first i was going to put it on that wall but then it was kind of like blocking my closet so i don't know i didn't really want to do that and i think i might get like a tension rod and do a curtain over my closet just to make it look a little less cluttered but i don't know let me know what you guys think I moved like my makeup little utility cart kind of as a nightstand right by my bed, which actually works because if you're charging your phone or something, sleeping on that side of the bed, it works and like the top of it is my bookshelf so and like my YouTube sign, so the top does look really cute. Um, and then I made this clothing rack. I got this from Wayfair, so I'll have it linked down below, but I put all my cute jackets on here just because these things are really pretty and they add kind of like color to my room, but also they took up a ton of space in my closet. So now that I have them here, it's just like kind of like an accessory and I think it's really cute. And then I moved my dresser to this side and the jewelry is up there. That is like uneven, like this has way more space than this, but I don't know, I don't care that much some people are gonna freak out in the comments um and then my dresser 
right here. I need to put this in a purse so this will not be staying there. But yeah, so this is kind of an overview. Oh, and then I moved my rug to in front of my bed because if I put it here, I was like, yeah, that would be just like way too much stuff. So that is an overview. I have become obsessed with it though. Like I'm really, really in love with this room and I'm so happy that I have space for all of this stuff. So yeah, that's also a huge mess, but eh. <laughs> ignore it. <laughs> and I picked up this book yesterday. I'm really excited to read it. It's from the Amazon store. They have one here, The Coddling of the American Mind. I don't know, it looked interesting, so had good reviews and has won a bunch of awards. So I'm excited to read this. I'm gonna wait to shower because it's currently 11.50 and I have a call at 12. So I feel like I don't have time to do a shower right now. So I'm going to wait a little bit and then shower um, after my call and then head over to Williamsburg to do some work with my friend Maddie. So I'm about to head out. I'm about to reapply my deodorant just because I just showered and every time I shower I always reapply. I don't know. Does anyone else do that? Because I still don't really know. I feel like it's going to be so humid outside today because it's supposed to rain later. So I just wore my hair up in this bun just because I didn't really feel like doing anything to it. And also I'm not wearing any makeup today because I have been wearing makeup like every single day since I've moved here and I need a day where I just let my skin breathe and I hate putting on makeup. So... I am just having this day to let my skin breathe and going makeup free, which I'm really, really happy about. I'm wearing this top from Brittany Melville. These jeans are American Eagle and my Nike Air Force Ones. Tiny little necklace. I think I got this in like a FabFitFun box. And then my Jared earrings, which I wear. Like these are the gold ones every single day. So this is the look. Made it to Brooklyn. This is Williamsburg. I love Williamsburg. What? Yeah. I think I'm going right there. It's like a really cool coffee bar coffee shop I hope they have food because I'm starving but I think that's where I'm meeting Maddie this place is so cute I just got this acai bowl it looks so good I'm with Maddie and then this coffee shop slash hotel slash restaurant is really really cute in Williamsburg she's showing me around <laughs> but this looks so good and then I also got an oat milk latte and this is my lunch shop here in Brooklyn and Maddie already left because she had to go back home uh, to fix something on her computer but I am getting so much work done so I'm being very very productive and I'm hoping it doesn't look like it's raining but it was raining earlier today and this is all I brought like I don't have a rain jacket or an umbrella or anything like that but I've just been getting a lot of work done I am going to leave soon I didn't bring a charger and my phone's already at 20% and I don't know I don't want my phone to die especially because I don't know how to get back exactly so I'm going to leave pretty soon and then continue doing some work at home. It's already 4.10, so I've been here for like three hours. Um, so I have been pretty productive, but I just can finish everything else at home and charge my phone and stuff. So I'm dumb. I definitely should have brought an iPhone charger. <laughs> to get off a few stops early and just enjoy the walk because it's pretty cool outside it's a little humid but it still feels really nice so I got a few stops early and walked a bit and it feels really really nice outside and that's another way I like to exercise in New York like I always meet my move goal just because I am whoops I'm supposed to go here just because I am constantly walking so constantly moving and also trying not to get hit by a car what's up guys i'm filming on my macbook but i am going to end the vlog here i feel like there was enough footage and i'm back editing it and like working on my computer and i know my feet look really weird in the background i'm sorry but thank you guys so much for watching be sure to check out native again if you guys want to get 20 percent off click on the link and use my promo code but thank you for them for sponsoring today's video it is a little later now i've been staring at a screen for way too long so hopefully i'm just gonna relax and i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys